Doreen Schmidt is a chemist. She needs to prepare 28 ounces of an 8% hydrochloric acid solution. Find the amount of 14% solution and the amount of 7% solution that she should mix to get this solution. So what we want to do is set up a table. And when we set up that table, it tells us that she needs 28 ounces of the 8% solution. We want to know how many ounces of the 14% and how many ounces of the 7% that we should mix together in order to get what we're looking for. So we have a first solution with a 7% concentration. We don't know the ounces, the number of ounces, that's what we're going to solve for. So we are going to assign that our x variable. Our second solution is the 14% solution. Once again, we don't know the, the, the number of ounces, so we'll go ahead and assign that our y variable. And then we do know that we need that 8% solution, and we do know that we need a total of 28 ounces. In this column here, our ounces of pure acid, what we do is just multiply the two together. So we, we transfer or move our percentage over to a decimal translate. So it goes from 7% to 0.07 and we multiply together so it's 0.07x. For the second solution we multiply together and get 0.14x and then for our mixture needed which is the 8% we multiply 0.08 times 28. So that's how we set up the table. The next thing we want to do is get a, a system of equations together. So the first thing we want is to get the ounces of solution and put that into our first equation. So if we say x plus y equals 28, that will give us our first mm -hmm. equation. The second equation we want to set up is our ounces of pure acid. So we have 0.07 plus 0.14 equals, when we multiply 0.08 times 28, we get 2.24. Now we're working with decimals and whole numbers, which we don't want to do. So we would like to take this equation, 0.07x plus 0.14y equals 2.24, and we want to multiply that by 100. And when we do that, we get 7x plus 14y equals 224. Now we're going to use a process of elimination to solve for the variables, which means we'll be able to solve for the amount of solution that we need. We have x plus y equals 28, and we have 7x plus 14y equals 224. So what we want to do is take that first formula and multiply it by negative 7. And when we do, we get negative 7x minus 7y equals negative 196. Now you can see here that we're going to be able to eliminate our x variable to be able to solve for the y variable. So 7x minus 7x leaves us with nothing. 14 minus 7 is 7y and 224 minus 196 is 28 and then when we solve for y we get 4. Okay, now all we do is take the y that we've solved for and plug it back into our first formula which is x plus y equals 28 and that will give us our x. So if we do that we get x plus 4 equals 28, subtract 4 from both sides, and we get 24. So, in order to get the 8% solution, 28 ounces of the 8% solution, we need 24 ounces of the 7% solution, and we need 4 ounces of the 14% solution. And that's the answer.